Lego Lego Lovers Lego Friend 46 here and, to and today I'm going to show you what could be the if not one one of if not the biggest set that I've ever reviewed sorry about not uploading last week but I just wanted a bit of me time with the new Lego set and trust me this was a big surprise when I came home from school on I think it was yesterday I did I had I thought this was going to come on Sunday but it came yesterday so here I am reviewing it and so let's get right into it i'll just plunk this down there and one of them's fallen over so here we have like a mini build this is just like a bunch of like little two stud pieces with this this is meant to be represent like a pavement where this guy gets his foot stuck in which i think is really hilarious there's even there's even a little stud i think there was a scene like this in the trailer except it was a bride and groom she might have the same hairstyle as the bride but uh, yeah she actually does and just replace this guy with a groom and it is. It is what it is. Now more on, on the guy. He's wearing some brown trousers. He's got an ice lolly. Maybe he was at the ice maybe he was at the ice cream shop when Garmadon attacked. And he's got some a t shirt with fish on it and and some PG. I think that's writing from Japanese. Hmm. And she's also holding an ice cream. Maybe they're family. So, and she also, and like him, she has two faces. She has a scared face and a like, oh no, I'm so sorry face. I don't know what face that is, but I think it's that when she when he catches up and gets annoyed that she's left him. Oh, and also he has here a face, another scared face, which I forgot to mention. Now onto Garmadon. This guy is has like this giant bazooka kind of rifle. He's got a jellyfish hat. And this, and you just push this down, and this bit fires out. The fish is holding onto the gun. Seriously, I feel really bad for these fish. What did they ever do to you, Garmadon? Seriously. And here we have the hammerhead shark, one of my personally favourite minifigures. And this is a hammerhead. I do like the great white small, but the hammerheads are still cool. Got the oxygen tank, and yet another tortured fish, who they've jabbed a hammer in its mouth. I can't emphasize this enough. What did the fish do to you, Garmadon? Report that to your boss for me, please. Thank you. Here we have Zane, the Ice Ninja. He's got his bow and arrow and a little pack for, for spare arrows. And he also has two faces. Uh, an angry face and a smiley face. And and unlike most ninjas, he's the little bit round here is white instead of black. So that makes him unique. And here we have Kai, the pilot of the star of this set. He's got his two katanas. Unlike the Spinjitsu training set, he's doesn't he doesn't come with a little little pack. But I but I do have a special way of doing that. It it doesn't really work for Kai, but it does work for the other ninjas. Um, I'll upload that video later, up uh, so, some other time, not not right after this one. And he has two faces angry face and a like and a smiley face like an awkward smile i think that's what it is same as the lady with the ice cream and here we have the brick separator where you used to separate the bricks it's a little bent so it's not really gonna work very well but at least we got it could make some interesting builds as well now we have the one the only fire mech as i said before this might be my biggest lego robot that i've ever got I did. This puts to shame Power Armor Lex Luthor from 2012. It it just it, it literally crushes it in every single way. So let's get right into it. I'm just gonna. As you can see, you, you just open the cockpit up by here, and here it's getting hard to hide Brickface Bill in the background because he always has to be on the shelves on here. We also have to constantly check to see if he's actually on camera. So I'm just gonna hide him in certain parts of the set. If you prepared, prepared trying to look for him, just leave it down in the comments. I'll be, I'll be sure to read them. So let's just get on to it. He's got two lights, a red light and a blue light. But to, actually, let's get have a little look inside the cockpit. Just remove Brickface Bill's two, two joysticks. Let's just get it. Come on, Brickface Bill. I know it's cool, but you can't stay in it forever. It's got that little seat at the back and, and the two joysticks. I might put a control panel there, but I'm saving it for something else. And it's got two flags. And it's and it's got two flags which are not made out of paper, they're made out of actual Lego. And here for his arms you just here's some like little shooters. You can just push this thing on the back of the like 
the big bulky arms and they get and you get these little things so which is really cool this this is one of my favorite mechs it, uh, now let's now as you can see he's got like giant flames with with that, that are posable and there's little knobs here that you can turn to make it spin around and here now we have like the gas tank i think it is where they you can, the ignition tank i think it'll go here we have these like really big bulky legs and there's even a place where you can flip up to, to get where you get little clips to hold Kai's weapons. I thought only Lloyd's mech had one for his weapon but I guess I was wrong. Well that's going to do it for this video guys. Hope you enjoyed it. My next video might be a little special because I'm going to introduce something probably none of you actually thought of before. But you'll just have to wait and see. If you prefer me hiding Brick Whisper in the background instead of featuring him in a main part of the set, just let me know down in the comments. I'll be sure to read them. See you next time. Bye.